Yep. Happy Sunday, everybody. It's going to be a quick video. Uh, just an update on my box. Well, bookend, not box. Bookend kit. Yep. Let's see. There we go. Went together pretty darn well. I think the only problem I had was this piece in the corner here. This going on flush, but did a little bit of clamp and just, well, with that face plate on, I just did a little clamp of the glue. Uh, it was the only problem. Everything was notched that where it should have been, but I think the little beam or little straight piece that goes in here to about right there to about right there. I don't think it was cut properly because I got I, when I put it to put this together I pushed it down as far as it would go and I glued the pieces that needed pieces needed to be glued but as you see yeah it's all pretty darn good I don't yeah I did glue this in uh, of course I just laid the glue before I put the top plate on it I laid, and Charlie I don't know how I did it buddy but I've got glue left over in my pack. I didn't have to use anything else. And the stuff dried pretty darn quick. So that's a bit of advice to anybody. Let you know. If you're in a semi-warm house. Not too hot. Not too cold. This glue does set up pretty fast. And it, it's good. It's, I think. I remember right. Yeah. And it dries. Pretty darn clear. You got a little. If you look at it, there's a little sheen there, but nothing, not really to talk about. But, yeah, it's one of those, uh, designed by Rebel Time, stories and books. It's pretty cool. It's a nice change. We got a little crow there. But, yeah, this thing had, uh, Missy. Oh yeah, one, two, three in the back behind the blue, uh, four, there's one up here, top five, I thought there were six, but I guess, anyway, all the lights, more or less, ran along little eye, eye holes, or tracks, and they all, these over here, ended up here, and shot across the top, went down, you brought the one around here. He went through two little eyelets right in here. And that one came down and they butted together and went down. And this last one here, it just had two eyelets on the side where, where that one is doing its business. Come out and just Y out. And it came down. You had, of course, color coded. And just more or less. Yeah, there was. Yeah, there was one over here and one over there. There was, I don't know. Anyway, of course your, and your card or board is right there. Uh, the battery box is back here, right there. Uh, you can pull it out from the bottom there. That's holding it in. I thought this thing opened up, but because it's got hinges to where you can spread it apart. This whole piece right there, sorry, that whole piece right there goes around there. And before I did the bracing or the everything around the, the back side, it would open up. I thought that was pretty cool. So if I took this off, in theory, the front and the back, it should just open right up perfectly. But anyway, yeah, all this is just wood, wood glued in. Get your little posters, whatever, flyers, your broom, a couple, one curl there. Uh, what's the other one? Oh, yeah. Got one here. I don't know there was three. One there, one in the street, and then, yeah, one in front right there. And they, had, they got, you got some of these with extra parts. This is three pieces here. You had that piece there. You had one in the center and the face plate. The windows and everything were more or less pressure fitted. I didn't have to really 
glue all of these in at all. And they're multiple pieces, of course, but... And this is just kind of a thick piece of cardboard. There we go. It just, it's got little creases in them to where it just forms. So you just a small bead of wood glue, whatever that stuff is, that white glue, that dries clear. And it just, yeah. There was a couple pieces where you had to kind of open up just a pinch more, but not hardly anything. And yeah, all this, all this stuff went on pretty nicely. So yeah, that's it. I thought this thing was broke at first. I didn't, I never even noticed the darn thing. Or... Uh, read the next set of instructions after the or the next step because I, Of course I kept Charlie in the loop on this. I wired everything up sent him a picture show it to him and then I Put the battery box where it was supposed to be wired it all up and turn that battery box on I thought that was the on switch. Yeah No, you just gotta pay attention and read I hit this one by accident and it came on I went, what the heck so yeah that's it for that she's done uh next thing i believe is going to be this being this would be what i want to take the acme and i went and purchased this it's a night rider light of course uh if anybody remembers a short-lived almost one season uh the new Knight Raider that came out, it was this car here that was part of it. GT500 King of the Road, 2008 Shelby. So, yeah, I'm gonna put the lights up in here and somehow work it. Of course, this is my first time lighting anything other than that. So, that gave me a little, uh, helped me along the way. But, yeah, I've already tested these out. They work. That's uh, 9 volt hookup and. And you can see right there's a push switch to turn it on and off. Think about running a 9 volt into the uh, top of that, or the inside of the uh, gas tank area. So yeah, I've got some work ahead of me. So that's about it, other than uh, we did a, oh, well Kenny did, we, I, I assisted just a little bit, very little. Uh, we had the uh, auction yesterday, which we did very well. I think we did like Oh, ended up with a little over thirteen hundred dollars that we uh, got for uh, Boyd for his uh, cancer treatment bills. So that was good. We will continue doing it too. Uh, just keep an eye on the Facebook page and the uh, YouTube channel. Uh, yeah, we'll probably do one every month until uh, we get rid of what kits we have here and volunteer uh, donated. Uh, I did pretty good, uh, all but. One of my kits that I donated was sold, so that was a good turnout. I got my Deadpool kit still to be sold. Cody's got his, oh, his pirate ship. Pirates Caribbean or something like that. I can't remember what it is. It's a red box. So he's got that yet to be uh, bought up. So other than that, it was a pretty good weekend. Uh, very productive yesterday. You can say while the auction was going on, I was I finished that up, so got very motivated. But yeah, I'm thinking I'm gonna get me. An, oh no, I'm gonna get me another one. And I've already decided. Well, how good you can see it, but yeah, I want to get that one of the train or the locomotive engine, whatever. That looks like a good fun one. Still need to finish my cyclops. It just needs painted. So is Michael Myers over over there. Get him all painted up and base and get that. <clears throat> get my cyclops over there painted. You can see the teeth. Done pretty good. There you go. It's a good, really good kid. Very proud of the head. The head's like a little too four. So, oh, oh, somewhere around six pieces. And you can't even see the seam lines. I mean, it went together that well. So, yeah. I got plenty to keep me busy this year. Of course, 
we've got the eggplant. Me and Charlie's got the eggplant root build going on in April. That's the only one I'm going to worry about other than the cancer build. Oops, sorry about that. Thumb popped out a slot. Or a joint, whatever. Yeah. It does it sometimes. But anyway, we'll see you all for the eggplant here. I'll probably do, well, I know Charlie will too. First of March, probably. First week of March, we'll probably do a you know, a reminder video let everybody know that you know about the eggplant. But other than that, I'm gonna get off here, go back to the video I was watching. I just wanted to get this video out real quick before I freaking brain farted, squirrel moment, and all that good stuff. Uh yeah. Temperature's been pretty good. Uh, they're gonna go I'm just dreading when it goes back to winter because I know when it goes back it's gonna go back hard. These warm temperatures are not what we're supposed to have right now. But we'll see. Maybe we'll luck out. It'll just be mild for the rest of the winter. Yeah. Might be better off going by a lotto ticket. Anyway, I'm going to get off here. Been babbling too much. Took care of business, and now I'm just rambling. So anyway, everybody, take care. When I have something else to show, I will. You know, take care.